What's going on guys? Welcome back to an episode of Snow Plowing Simulator. Last episode we, we continued on with our progress where we actually unlocked our new um, professional snow um, clearer thing here. And um, today we're going to actually work towards getting our snow blower. We got a petrol powered snow blower, a gas powered snow blower for you um, all of us American people. <laughs> but um, great start. <laughs> Just sliding down the hill here. There is some spiked snow tires, which we actually really need badly, but they're a thousand bucks for those. And obviously, we're trying to get um, a little bit more, which... Does this need to be cleared out again, actually? Let's take a look at this one, because this is the one that we cleared out. Oh, it is. It does. Okay, this one's actually quite a bit, though, so we're not going to do this one, at least not yet, um, for that. But if you guys are enjoying this, be sure to drop a like in the video. Show it some love and support. If you guys are new around you're checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. So you guys don't miss out on any videos that um, we are doing here. But um, I don't know what we're trespassing there. We're, we're just driving down the street. Oh, this... Um, hello? <laughs> okay, well, let's see our map here. Yeah, that, that is the one that I was looking... Oh, wait, no, that's not actually... Okay. So that's the wrong property that we're trying to go to here, but we are trying to get to a property, another one that's $200. It's a pretty small property, actually. So we need another 500 and some change, I believe, um, for this. So let's see here. Is that... Or maybe that was the one. Yeah, I think that was the one, actually. That seems like a much bigger property for that. So let's head down this way real quick. And let's see what we got to work with. But yeah, I would like to try to get our try to unlock the snow blower here if we can. Oh boy, this might be difficult to get back up this hill. I didn't realize that we had like a massive hill here. But um yes, yeah, definitely interesting. We got like a storm coming. Storm blowing through here too. Okay. Um ah. Taking a little bit to actually get down this way, but yeah, here's our other house right here, which this looks pretty big too, but I think this one was like $600. Um, honestly, this one's actually not too bad. Yeah, this actually won't be terrible. I say that and then that already starts. But no, it's just because we ran into that. Oh, you can drive and clear snow virtually. Any so we have a tractor? I guess we probably should have read that. Okay, we probably shouldn't have just skipped that. But, um... Yeah, we probably shouldn't have just skipped that, because they probably were telling, trying to tell us something. But, that's alright. We're going to go ahead and just clear out some snow with our push plow here. This thing's not terrible to use. Honestly, it's actually pretty pretty nice, for the most part. So we're going to go ahead, get all this cleared out. This shouldn't honestly take us too long for all of this. So let's just get this cleared out. Not complain about it, just get it done. Oh, we got a brick wall that we got to be careful of. Oof. That's a little scary, actually. The, um... Ooh. The thunder close by. It's actually, honestly, a little creepy, especially knowing that there's, like, a weird mystery with this town. Not really the sounds you want to be hearing. But... <laughs> there we go. Get all this cleared on out. Get it looking good. Get a nice straight line going down the rest of this way, and then... We'll, can, we'll get the um, area cleared up by the garage, and then we'll finish off the driveway here, and that'll be a complete job, and we should be able to get our snowplow, or our snowblower, actually, and try actually try that out, which I'm really excited for. Um, let's try to clear out a nice path here. Honestly, I think I'd rather use this in a, than a snowblower anyways, or than, um, like, a, a tractor. This thing's honestly much easier to use anyways. I know we checked that we checked out a tractor in the uh, prologue, 
of this. And it was fun to use, definitely. Don't get me wrong, but... I don't know. This seems just honestly fairly easy just to use this and just do it this way. No fussing about with the uh, equipment and trying to turn a blower back on, on and off. And how are we able to just go over that, though? That doesn't make any sense. I didn't even know what that was there. I say that we're probably going to start running into it now. Yeah, some of the weird, some of the things that we like clip through in this game is interesting that we clip through the certain things and then some things we get run into and actually get stopped and like pushes our snow off into a pile. I don't understand that, but that's all right. I know, again, the game is still early access with this, but I'm curious to see what you guys think of this because I am really thoroughly enjoying this, but I hope you guys are too. Let's run this out over here then. I don't know if we're, like, supposed to have the tractor in for this, and that's why it was popping up, or what, but, yeah, we're just gonna, we're gonna finish it up with this. I'd actually rather just have these bigger driveways and such to clear, because they're honestly pretty easy. I mean, the paths, if it's just, a, like, a straight line, single path, like, walkway, that's easy to clear it with this, then, but this honestly is not hard either, and this is a lot more square footage, and we can charge more for it, then, so... I'd rather do this anyways. But, um, yeah. So we got a few more passes with this only, and that's already about it for that. And I think, again, I think this one was a $600 payment, so we should get seven or 800 with a with a tip, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. So that's where we definitely want to do a good job on this and get 100% on this. I see we got a little bit of snow on the right, right edge there that we may have to clear out. But uh, we will see. Okay, two more passes here, and we should be good to go. And again, maybe a little bit on the edge there, on the one edge. Potentially, we got a little bit down the end here, we may have to clear out. But we'll figure it out. Alright, we're at 96.6. Okay. And... There we go. That's 100%, baby. That's what we want to see. Let's get... Yes and yes. Yeah, 900... Holy crap, $900. Um, Have you seen what's in the shed? Talk to the owner. Maybe we can agree on something. Where's the owner? Yeah, I'm assuming we were supposed to... We were supposed to... Oh, here's the owner. How you doing? Uh, good morning. Thank you for the good job. Since there is no husband, there's no one to do it. Um, Any time. I remain at your disposal. You have my number. Let's stay in contact. So let's see. Let's take a look at the shed back here. Can we? Or is this off limits? Oh. You have like a guest house kind of thing. Oh, okay. Here's the tractor. But there's no plow. No snowblower. Okay, I'm not too sure. Yeah, we can't, like, go into the little, like, guest cabin or whatever this is. I'm assuming we're going to have to clear this out at some point, probably. Yeah, we can't talk to her again. Okay. Well, that's fine. Let's um, head on back to the shop. We got, some new we got something else to unlocked as well. So we got to try to trek back up the hill here if we can. We're actually close to being able to afford the snowblower and um, the spike tires as well, which is awesome. Obviously, we can't afford it quite yet, but actually, this isn't doing too bad. We're making it up the hill better, much better than I thought. The physics of this are a little interesting, too. Like, you just bounce straight off the wall when you'd be going at it at an angle, and you'd, like, bounce, like, sideways into it, not just, like, head-on and just, like, stay head-on. It would, like, bounce, turn you if that was real life. But uh, yeah, we're gonna make our way back up over here. So it's kind of like the in, kind of like when you first clear out snow. It's just like a smaller job for them, and then it gets a lot bigger, typically. Look at that little drift. Actually, oh, hold it, hold it, hold it. Ah, look at that. There we go. Okay. 
I love that. Um, all right. So yeah, let's head into our sh to our shop here and let's check out some our new equipment. Let's see if we can get. The, we should be able to get the actual s snowblower here. Uh, let's see. So okay, we got more tires unlocked. Uh, tractor, tractor. So we need some good tires for the tractor once we get one of those plows. Or wait, do we just like take the take the tractor? Is that where we get the tractor now? But um, there we go. We got the uh, petrol snowblower now. Be delivered by the courier. Okay. So let's see what we got for jobs now. Um. So that's done. This is one that is recommended for the or the recommended for the petrol blower. Um. That's one that we've already done. I kind of want to try something a little bigger. Like this is another six hundred. We these are both six hundred dollar jobs. So let's go to this road over there and check these out. Then, why not? That's a snowblower there. <laughs> All right. We have our... Oh, there we go. Let's... That's it. I mean, I guess it's nice in terms of... I was definitely expecting a wider spray. But I guess that's um, not bad. <laughs> I was definitely expecting... Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I looked away for two seconds. Definitely. They have like a lion or something in their backyard, like a statue. Okay. I see we do have four-wheel drive with this thing. I don't know if we're going to be able to get the truck out of here. We might be stuck down here. That's just a tree, but we might be able to climb out of here. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, actually, we're good. Okay. We're good. Um, let's see the map here. These are the two houses. So, I mean, let's give it a try with the snowblower. I mean, obviously, it's going to be nice, though, because it's going to throw the snow out of our way. We're not going to have to deal with any piles of it. Um, oops. I accidentally skipped that, but that's all right. Um, okay, let's... Oh, look at... Okay. That is pretty nice, so I will say that. Again, it is just a little bit smaller of an area than I expected. But that is pretty nice to not have to worry about the snow at all. Oops. Misclicking there on accident. Yeah, that is... That is definitely nice. I, I do like that, I will say. I mean, look at that. Okay. That is pretty cool. Again, it doesn't clear out as big of an area, so I don't really like that, but that is nice to be able to just clear out a big sec- or, um, not have to worry about the snow at all. We can just run along here. And not have to worry about anything. We can just go along and do our thing. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that, that is pretty cool. I like that. I don't know if it's, like, the ultimate thing, but it is definitely pretty nice. Yeah, let's. We're gonna do both of these houses here. Make some. Oh, wait, why? Okay. Yeah, again, that that is pretty nice to not have to worry about clearing out any extra snow. It just blows it out of the way and it's gone. Yeah, that is that is pretty cool. I do like that. Again, I don't know if it's like the ultimate thing that solves all of our problems, but it definitely is nice to have for sure. We're just gonna get all of this cleared on out. Real quick though, we're gonna do the do the house down the street as well right away. And then we'll be good to go with this. We're gonna make we should make nine hundred dollars for this one and nine hundred for the other one. So we might actually make enough for a plow, which would be really awesome. Nope, a little bit of lag there, but that's all right. Okay. 
Yeah, again, I kind of wish that this was a little wider. I mean, like, this is a pretty small snowblower in terms of snowblowers you can get. Like, I used to use a pretty wide, like, 24, 28-inch one. This is, like, a 20-inch, maybe, something like that. Like, one of the small, little, like, tiny ones that uh, you can purchase. And they're not, like, self-propelled or anything. They just, they're just push ones that you have to push and don't clear out a ton of it. They're not very powerful either. But, um... Yeah, I don't know. We'll certainly see what equipment we can get a what equipment we can get access to. Obviously, we know where a tractor is now. I just don't know if we can, like, use that or how that works um, with that. But yeah, let's get all this cleared on out. We're going to try to tackle the other house that's just down the street since while we're here. And um, go from there with it. Okay. I do like this, though. Oh, we missed a little spot there, I think. It does seem to do good with, like, clearing out extras that you, like, miss a little bit, though. Okay, we should probably go in the middle here and just go back a little ways. So this is a little bit wide in certain spots. Yeah, we're at 90... basically 99%. Last little bit right here, then. And there we go. Just finish this off. We got... Another couple of percent, and there's a hundred percent, baby. That's what we want to see. All right, let's go ahead finish this bad boy up. Four minutes that just took only nine hundred bucks for that. Not too shabby. Let's head on outside. Figure appeared. Some kind of figure I saw. Thirty-two something. Oh wait, I see. That's right. There's a the little mystery icons that we can follow on our. Indicator down uh, below, right down at, at the bottom. And there, I kind of forgot about that. So I think that's what we're supposed to kind of be using to follow to uh, get back to things. Um, okay. Yeah, we got actually quite a bit with this one. So I think... Well, I don't know. Maybe we'll use our... Our snowblower is good, but again, it does take a little... Let's try our, our pusher. This thing is just so nice with how wide it can go. I know we gotta go, like, back and forth and stuff, but it's like we clear out so much snow with just a single push. Okay, I, I, I still think that this is the way to go. I really do. I think this is the I think this is the way. If you know the way, you take the way. <laughs> At least for now. Once we get our snow plow, then that that will probably be the new way. I see we got our wall like to the to the side of us there, so we need to be careful of that. I don't know if that would if we'd run into that at all. Oh, we're actually missing a few little spots. I haven't seen this thing miss anything yet. So that's actually kind of surprising. Like look, it's like skipping right there. Alright, um, so there's all of that. Let's get this little bit. We gotta go back up and get that. It's getting really dark again though. Another little storm rolling in. Honestly, creepy with the um, the wind sounds. Again, with having like some sort of mystery around us. Not the most heartwarming um, sound. <laughs> but anyways. Okay. Let's clear out a bit more snow here on this little spot. These few little spots. Which again, I don't know why this is actually leaving stuff. This like never does. I don't know why that's... Doing that. Let's just push the snow up into his driveway. <laughs> there we go. Oof. That is so creepy. Just gave me chills. Okay. Let's get this last little bit right here. We're already, I mean, we're 50% of the way, so not um, actually all that great. Not that much done. Compared to how long we've been at this, but that's alright. This is worth to get another 900 bucks so we can get some studded tires, work toward... Actually, you know what? We could get our, our plow. We probably should get some studded tires before the plow. Probably make more sense to do that. 
but I don't know. We will see with that. Okay. So there is that. Yeah, we probably should do some of the mystery stuff. I kind of want to now that I see the mystery, like, question mark things in the bottom center again now. So we'll have to uh, go ahead and probably work at some of those in the next episode with this. We're already too far into this one. Okay. Yeah, again, let me know what you guys think of this if you guys want to see more of this, because I'd be down to do this. I am pre-recording a bunch of videos before my uh, trip here, and um, this is actually the last one I'll be, I'll be pre-recording of this. So I'll have plenty of time to get your guys' feedback on this and see what you guys think um, before um, I get back and record more videos for you guys to enjoy. But I'd be down to do some more of this um, if you guys do want to see that. But yeah, there we go. We got... Here comes in again. Jeez. Honestly, he's giving me the chills. Okay. So yeah, we got a few passes to make with this, and then we are all... Why are we missing stuff here? I don't understand that. Okay, I guess we'll go ahead and do our thing with this and just make our passes, and we'll clean up, clear up whatever we have to at the end of this. Okay, we got like two more here then to do. We might not even have to here. This might be enough with just this. Uh, again, we got, I guess, one little spot there. It seems like if you get too much snow, I guess that's when it seems to happen for that. So let's go up the middle here. Get this. This little bit right here. And that is 100% right there. I'm good with that. We get a few little extra spots. We don't really need to worry about... There we go. We got another 900 bucks in our pockets. Right there from that. Got something new unlocked in this door. Always a good thing. Oh, figure appeared again. Okay. So, um, yeah. That is going to wrap up this one, guys. So, if you guys enjoyed this... Be sure to drop a like in the video, show us some love and support. If you guys are new around here checking this out, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss out on any videos that we're doing here. But we're, again, if you guys want to see some more of this, let me know. But uh, if we do come back in this, we're going to continue on with some of the mystery stuff and um, seeing what's up with the town and also checking out some new equipment and everything. But again, that's going to wrap up this one, guys. So thank you all very much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out, guys.